Brakti Hawa Brakata Yao Sha Brakti Hawa Brakata Yao Sha Ba Shah Rakakwadash Daba honor to the apostles, the elders, salutations to you, sincere brothers teaching and truth and in sincerity. Lesson will be entitled Rich and Poor, Small and Great. Source CNBC article entitled 75 percent of middle class households say their income is falling behind the cost of living published July 18th, 2022. The reality of inflation and the specter of a recession appear to be weighing heavily on middle class households among those whose income falls in the 30,000 to 100,000 range, 75% say their earnings are falling behind the cost of living. And 77% think the U.S. will be in a recession by the end of 2022, according to a recent survey from Primerica. There's also been a general uptick in financial worries in the last six months, with 39% of those surveyed expecting to be worse off financially in a year up from 32% in March and 28% in December 2020-11. In December 2020, that share was 17%. There's a higher level of concern financially among middle income families then there was even at the height of fill in the blank, said Glenn Williams, CEO of Primerica. The June survey of nearly 1,400 adults was done as part of Primerica's quarterly check-in on the financial security of middle-income families. Tougher decisions around priorities. Inflation has taken a toll on households, rising 9.1% in June from a year earlier, marking the fastest pace since 1981 and affecting items ranging from groceries and gas to clothes and cars. When you see rising prices and staples like gas, rent, things you can't avoid. It comes down to tougher decisions around priorities, Williams said. Income also isn't keeping up. The latest reading of hourly wages showed a 5.1% increase in June from a year earlier, which means inflation has generally wiped out the boost in income okay key point when you see rising prices and staples like gas rent things you can't avoid it comes down to tougher decisions around priorities and although you may get a raise what happens Inflation has generally wiped out the boost in income. Actions middle-income consumers will take to handle inflation. Work longer before retirement, 42%. Cut back, pause saving in an emergency fund, 30%. Delay car repairs, 29%. Find a higher paying job, 22%. Increase credit card use, 19%. Tap retirement savings, 14%. Cut back, pause retirement savings, 14%. Cut back, pause student loan debt payments, 13%. Cut back, pause credit card payments, 9%. None of these. 26%. Inflation always hurts those who make less money because the portion of their income that goes to necessities is much higher than that of wealthier people, said Catherine Hoyer, 
a certified financial planner with Wilson David Investment Advisors in Atkins, South Carolina. And as you can see, the middle class continues to get smaller and smaller. Eventually, until you have what? Revelation. Chapter 13, verse 16. And he caused all, both small and great, rich and poor. As you can see, no middle, no middle class. See, the middle class is the heart of the economy. And via prophecy, Revelation 13 and 16. And he caused all, both small and great. Rich and poor, free and bond to receive a fill in the blank in the right hand or in their foreheads. Okay, and the he is referring to the nobility of Edom. Okay, the international bankers who control this entire system. The game plan is to attain what? Job 5 and 13. You know what? Let's start at 12. He disappoint. Who is the he? Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, the devices of the crafty. Now, the crafty is, is also referring to the nobility of Edom. And a device of the crafty is what? Wiping out the middle class, ushering in a universal, right? Basic income so that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. Enterprise in the Hebrew is referring to their success, referring to what? The new world order. All right? He disappoint the devices of the crafty so that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. And as you can see, it's only going to get worse. 75% of middle class households say their income is falling behind the cost of living. These individuals are having issues with keeping up. Now they have to make what? The tough decisions based on necessities. All right. At this time frame, they don't have desires. Why? Because the focal point is having their necessities. And even though they may get raises, right, at the same time frame, the inflation, all right, continues to make it hard for them to stay afloat. And this is all designed by the crafty, the nobility of Edom. But guess what? Who's in control of Edom? Daniel 4 17. This, this matter is by the decree of the watchers and the demand by the word of the holy ones to the intent that the living may know that the most high rule in the kingdom of men. See, the most high rules in the kingdom of men and give it to whomsoever he will and set up over it the basis of men. And Esau. All right, so-called white people based on the lineage of their fathers are the basis of men. And this also shows the mighty power of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, to take a base man and give him a great kingdom. However, we are in the end of Esau's kingdom. And it's going to get much worse. All right. Lord, will you edify Shalom?